Hey guys, it's uh, John Bellamy here. Listen, we've been talking about these uh, seven client generating email and chat scripts. Um, and if you recall, like we've got all of these seven different templates and everything here that you can go and utilize uh, to kickstart conversations, to ultimately go and drive permissions, to send more info over to people from that perspective. Um, we spoke about questions and templates that you can use um, to get a response from that people, to follow up people as well that have been unresponsive through your sales pipeline. Line. The list goes on, the list goes on, the list goes on, right? There's, so there's seven templates there. As always, if you haven't got those templates or anything like that as yet, what I want you to do is just message me, comment, whatever you need to do, just get in contact and we'll make sure that you've got um, these templates and everything over to you. But what I wanted to share with you today in this video is, is going, great, well, these are templates, but John, how can I actually utilize these for myself in my own business and actually put them to work. Um, so what I want to do is just spend a couple of minutes with you. And I wanted to share with you, a lot of us are talking about AI and whether we're using things like ChatGPT, Bard or other AI platforms out there um, to help us shortcut the process. Because, you know, I get it as small business owners, a lot of us might have a limited budget or limited time. Um, at the time with those limited budgets, we can't you know, a lot of the time can't go and afford five, 10, 15, $30,000 um, to engage a copywriter, although that is definitely worth the money at that point. Um, a lot of us just don't have the cash flow all the time to be able to do that right now. Um, but what I want to share with you is how you can do this and get a very similar type of response um, from creating quality conversational email copy and chat scripts utilizing things like ChatGPT. So I'm gonna jump over to ChatGPT and I'm, I'm gonna share with you um, the commands that we're gonna look like. So strap in, hope you find it of value. So let's jump over to ChatGPT. Now, real quick, I've already gone in and um, created uh, the actual prompts, okay? So I've got these here, but once again, if you want the templates and the prompts, just message me and we'll give them to you there. So what I did here was a very simple prompt. It was like, hey, ChatGPT, in a minute, I'm gonna ask you to act as my direct response marketing manager. I'd like you um, to help create an email based on a couple of things that I will provide. The first thing I will provide is my ideal client persona. I'd like, to, I'd like for you to review this persona and utilize it when crafting the emails for this campaign. Please remember to use the tone of voice that relates to this persona. So we'll share more about that in a moment with you. Um, the second thing um, that I'll provide is an email template. I'd like you to review the template and utilize this um, as the foundational template in the emails that you'll create. So once again, we're going to utilize one of these templates um, that we've created and shared with you from that aspect, right? Um, finally, I would like you to provide me with three variations of the email. A short punchy email under 80 words, a medium-sized punchy email under 130, and a longer form um, punchy email under 200 words. Note, um, for emails B and C, um, please include three bullet points within the body of the email. And then the final command here is we've gone, please don't start the process yet until I provide the uh, until I provide the additional information and command you to do so. Okay, so we're getting very clear. We're giving it a very simple and clear command um, to chat GPT. So let's just come back to here um, for a moment. And, and there's two things that I want to talk about. Number one is the buyer persona. Okay, um, the second thing I want to talk about is the tone of voice. And then the third, let's pick that template. So we have created a buyer persona. So here is a buyer persona for our inner circle program, our link authority inner circle program. You can see it goes into quite a bit of depth and search and um, breadth and all of that type of stuff. Um, if you'd like to have a look at this further, I mean, just once again, reach out. We're happy to help you out with this, but, but we show you exactly how to do this as part of our AI resource toolkit. So we're gonna utilize this buyer persona and you'll see here, as I mentioned, the second thing um, is this tone of voice. So this is what I'm talking about here. So when when ChatGPT and when I load this information to ChatGPT, it's gonna actually have a look at this entire document, but I want it to make sure that it looks at the tone of voice and utilizes that tone of voice when crafting the email, okay? So your tone of voice would be different to mine, would be different to Joe's next door, Mary's down the road, um, you know, and all of these things. So we wanna make sure that we've got those tone of voices right. Um, and then what we wanted to do then also was um, pick a template, okay? So for example, um, this template, 
that we're going to be utilizing this exercise here is the Kickstarter conversation. Okay, so we're literally using this template here, which is the sample email template one that you have, right? You can see it here from that perspective. So let's go back to ChatGPT. We've given it the first command. Okay, we've done that. ChatGPT has come back and gone, absolutely, I'm ready to assist you. Just let us know what uh, to do next, et cetera, et cetera. So it's just waiting. So what I've done here is this is the next prompt. I've gone, here is the tone of voice. Please do not start until I provide you with the email template, right? Um, and all I've done is I've gone and I've copied this entire document and I have pasted it here. So you can see here, I've literally just pasted all of our persona. Okay, our buyer persona and everything's just been pasted all in here. It's just going to keep scrolling down. Oh, here we go. And then it goes, ChatGPT goes, hey, thanks for the tone of voice and buyer persona. Um, waiting for you to proceed, right? So then now I go in here and I've just given it a very simple, once again, um, another command. I'm like, here is the email template. Now that you have this information, Please commence. And once again, I've just copied the email template that we spoke about before, dropped it below this email. You can see it all here. And then ChatGPT has gone fantastic with the detailed persona information, the email template you provided. I'm ready to create these three emails. So this is how cool and how quickly we can get these things moving, which is super cool for small business. So let's have a look at these um, short emails. Let's have a look at email one. Okay, which is variation A, short, under 80 words. Um, notice here that the subject line, what the, you'll notice that they're all slightly different. And, and the way that ChatGPT has done this, it's spoken to our three buyer personas. So the first one here, Sam, um, is sort of under that 150K bracket. Okay, so they could be doing 50 grand, 100 grand, 120, whatever it is, but they want to get past that 150K bracket. So it's like, hey, Sam, are you grappling with digital marketing mysteries and CRM conundrums? Um, let us simplify this. Our link authority in a Circle program is here to boost your business with hands-on mentorship. Are you available for a quick 10-minute chat about turbocharging your marketing and scaling beyond 150K? Talk soon, John Bellamy. Okay, so that's such a cool, short, punchy email. And it's written it, I believe, in, and I hope you do as well, written in a really good conversational way that is so in line with number one, A, our buyer persona, and most importantly, in my opinion, two, our tone of voice. Okay, um, fantastic from, from that perspective. So if we just go back to the email, we're reaching out to target market like yourself, who's rapport building line to help them with X, Y, Z. Essentially, we blah, 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 blah. So it's it's given us that really good type of looking at that template, utilizing that, holding it tightly but lightly, and giving us a really good short, punchy, under 80 word email, right, that we can use. We could use that email, LinkedIn, Facebook Messenger, whatever we want to do. So that's pretty cool. Um, the second one that we have here, which is variation B, which is a medium length email um, under 130 words um, from that perspective. So medium length for me, that's that's what I look at. And this is Grace, um, is 500K just the beginning for you? So this is Grace, our second persona, who's doing 500K or 150 to 500 and wants to maybe push beyond. Um, so like, hey, Grace, we see you scaling ambitiously, yet um, leaving more for your marketing, more from your marketing spend. Our mission to catapult catapult businesses like yours to astonishing heights, transforming, so here's the bullets, transforming tight budgets into powerful ad campaigns, streamlining customer management with, uh, with savvy CRM tactics, um, converting every marketing dollar into tangible growth. Curious about how we can amplify your turnover or your 500K turnover? Uh, let's chat for 10 minutes about maximizing your effectiveness um, and setting new growth milestones. Talk soon, John, right? Um, pretty cool. Once again, it's it's gone to a different persona within our persona range um, and, it's, and it's incorporated. It's a longer form email, a medium size, and it's incorporated three bullet points. So I'm super stoked about that. Uh, and then finally, let's have a look at variation C, which is the longer form one, under 200 words. Um, so this is Alex. Alex, conquer complexity and soar beyond a million bucks. So that's our third persona that we're after there. Hey, Alex, you've just hit the inevitable $1 million. Cutting through the sales and marketing automation maze, optimizing operations for next level growth, leveraging tech to boost lead generation and customer engagement. Um, it's not just about growth. It's about smart, sustainable expansion. Our bespoke mentorship tailors to your unique challenges, 
helping you navigate the complexities of scaling up. Um, how about a 10-minute conversation to discuss strategies that could propel your business beyond the 1 million frontier and streamline your marketing and sales processes? Talk soon, John Bellamy. Now, that's it. Literally, you can see I'm sharing the chat GPT thing. I have not made any tweaks, nothing as yet. Could I make some tweaks? Of course we could do those things. But this is literally getting very clear on how we prompt ChatGPT from that perspective to help our growing small business actually create some really compelling quality conversational marketing material. So I hope you can see that from that aspect. So what, what have we utilized here? Let's just break this down, summarize this, and I really wanna make sure that you take away some gold nuggets from this. What have we utilized from here? Well, number one, um, we've utilized these, these seven marketing um, scripts, email chat scripts, uh, plates, all of these things. And we've just picked one of them right? So we've utilized that information. Um, because many of us are a small business that's growing, we may or may not have the funds right now or the time right now to go and engage the services of a very qualified copywriter from that aspect. We're like, okay, well, how can we leverage technology or, or systems to help us do this? So we're utilizing ChatGPT. And all we've done is we've taken that chat script our buyer persona, and let's be clear, we utilize ChatGPT to help us build that buyer persona as well, um, and a few different prompts, okay? One prompt, two prompt for the persona, three prompt for the actual email template. Three prompts in ChatGPT, and it managed to produce an amazing uh, three-part email or three separate emails that we could use for each one of those personas. Pretty cool, right? So guys, I just wanted to share that with you. Um, in summary, once again, if you haven't for whatever reason got your hands on, on the email templates and chat scripts, message me, let me know. Um, at that same time, I'll gladly give you the prompts as well that you can go and utilize um, inside of ChatGPT, for example, to go and build out this type of thing for you. And as always, if you'd like to know more how you can better leverage your marketing, whether it's writing copy, emails, the automation, anything like that, just drop me a line. Um, and I really think that for a lot of you, our AI resource toolkit, which goes into a heap more depth than what we've been talking about today, and this could be right up your alley. So if you've got any questions, concerns, want these scripts or not, um, just send me a message, comment below, and we'll get these over to you. Anyway, guys, it's John Bellamy here. Trust you found that of value. Talk again real soon. Bye for now.